Remember when George Clooney was Batman? Well, if you forgot, don't worry, George is not. And he has no problem poking a little fun at himself. George went there when asked, who should be the next in line to don the Cape Crusaders costume? I freeze. I'm Batman. I'm not sure. Um, I screwed it up so badly, I'm not allowed to weigh in on any of those subject matters anymore. Help me save another life. You actually thought I was the best Batman. You said I that. I did say that. Yeah, it's tough. In a new interview for Variety, George sits down with Christopher Abbott, who co-stars with Clooney in Catch-22. That's some catch, that Catch-22. George also directs the Hulu limited series. It's his return to the small screen, which launched him into superstardom. I've been binge-watching ER. <laughs> I haven't watched it yet. E.T. was with George from the beginning of ER, where he gave us a tour of the set. This is part of the whole catheter, no, Junior, don't squeeze the catheter bag thing. But Christopher never watched George's Dr. Doug Ross. I haven't. No? No. It wasn't required. Oh, it was that on the syllabus? Oh, never mind. That was on the syllabus. I'm still editing, you know. Things can happen. The two are on the cover of the new issue of Variety. Christopher used to play Allison Williams' boyfriend on Girls. Who knew George was a fan? Sort of. That's how we got the part, was because I'm a I watch girls sort of religiously. I actually went back and watched a couple of episodes of Chris on Girls, and I listen, it's not fully my cup of tea as a show, but that's you know, probably because I'm a 57-year-old man, you know. He's a wonderful actor, so he did a great job. I can't, I can't be rotten right now. I want to be, but I, don't, I have nothing rotten to say right now. I will. I'll find something. Insanity is contagious. Okay, so George has nothing bad to say about his co-star, but guess what? His twins will turn two on June 6th, and there is nothing like those terrible twos.